Uh, all right, guys, I'm out. Best of luck. Thank you. Thank you. I will be watching with bated breath. I actually have to pee before. <laughs> Dude, before a tournament match, I go to the bathroom at least seven times. It is in bed. Yeah. Valid? Either that or I have to leave mid set and that's it. Not commentating, gotta go. Sorry, come on here with me. Come on. It's Rick, but spelled weird. We had a lot of people in chat. You won't have me on the mic. That's okay. Say Rick for me in chat, please. And make sure you spell it wrong. Actually, the weirdest spelling wins. And what do you win? Our love and friendship. I might give you some channel points. Ooh! I don't even think we have channel points. I don't know. But don't tell them that. I'm, that's between you and me. I'm kind of out of the know. I don't really know what channel points are. Right. I'm going to keep it creamy with you. Okay, so who's actually up next? Do you know? Uh, Crispy Gujan versus Tadaro. Crispy Kuyon? <laughs> <laughs> Crispy It's right at the bottom. Oh, you can oh, ignore gotcha. the bad poetry and the, you know, grocery okay. list. Sure. Okay, versus who? Todaro. T-O-D-A-R-O. And uh, I'm pretty sure I know who they're playing. I think they had a an agreement between them that there would be no Ashra, which is interesting. So no Ashra? How much? How much? And first to what? 100 first to 10. By the way, this is Curls, everybody. Thank y'all so much for the support. I super appreciate it. Sorry, I'll let y'all down. Exactly the same. $100 first to 10? $100 first to 10. All right, bet, bet, bet. Uh, Mr. Extraordinary is really good, by the yes. way. Yes! Uh, yes! Like, I know I know. it seems like that I was making no a lot Astra. of... No I was making a lot of mistakes, because I was, uh, and he was capitalizing off on my frost assist a lot once he figured out, like, when to flip heads. Because that's a thing with that, with the Omni-Man thing. You flip heads three, t or you have to flip heads three times in order to get through it. But he just read the frost assist every single time, got punished for it. He's really good. As y'all saw, all the damage he was getting off of every interaction. I mean, that's an important part, having the, the readiness to just execute your combos whenever possible. And believe it or not, even though I went, what, 10 and 2, right? That's right. Yeah, 10 and 2. That's the best I've ever done in this game. So, improvement! It is! No, very, absolutely. That's the first time I've ever taken a game off of him, actually, in, 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 in NRS. We've played since Injustice 1. <laughs> Holy shit. Yeah, yeah, we've played what since... What a in storied friendship. Oh, I love that. Cornbread, my it's boy! So you cool. actually tuned in. I'm so happy to see you in chat. That makes me so happy. It's so wonderful to see how serious these players get before these matches. Oh, yeah. Some people have the routines, you know, like uh, almost almost like you're walking up to the free throw line, you know, for an NBA <laughs> game. I'm not even joking. Like, you know, you have your two dribbles and your spin, you know. It's just like some players, they got the they got the, this is the, mine. the towel, you know. Yeah, wipe your hands wipe off. Wipe your hands on your pants. Shake your head a little bit. Shake your hands. Kids at home, that's a pro strat from Kilgore Trout. But left, right, left. Get that nerd grease. Really, you don't want that on your controller because it's going to slip up. Oh, yeah, mess up your inputs that way. Yes, Cornbread, I am so down. We, we will hit the lab together, absolutely. Next, Frame Data Friday. Tell us more about Frame Data Fridays. <laughs> so, me, Mr. Extraordinary, 
and then there's a friend of ours from like Charles Funzi. Uh, we actually all meet up online every night from like 10 p.m. to 2 a.m. and just frame day to Friday. We'll do a King of the Hill. We'll play a bunch of matches. But if someone has a question on like certain things, we'll stop what we're doing and we'll all lab it as a group. So like we'll like find that certain so cool. we'll find like certain scenarios. This is like okay, well what's that like? Are you plus or negative on that? Okay, well what can we do in a situation to where if I get hit, if you're negative on that? And you that's know, so, the real Wuxi Academy right there. You know, so we call it Frame Day to Friday. Sharing knowledge is not a weakness. I know a lot of people are like, I should say, but how are you going to get better if you don't have something for every situation? Exactly, exactly. So we got a button check right here. Uh, Crispy Gujon versus Todaro. I believe we need a swap side. Oh, okay. I was about to say, I yeah. thought Todaro was the Raiden. So let me do this real quick. Todaro versus Todaro. Absolutely. How you been? It's good to see you. It's good to see you. Thank you. You know, I'm so happy to be here. I know it's been a while since I've showed my face. I've just been super impressed with all the the band stuff. Uh, For those of you who don't know, I'm pretty active in this band in New Orleans. We play a ton of shows. Uh, We've been together for a little over a year, and our show count is like 20, 20, 22. Okay. Okay, okay. And uh, we've been prepping for a big show in January. Oh, bet. Okay. And we'll get back to that later, because right now the button checks are done. We are not Hollywooding. All right. So I actually have a little bit of experience in this uh, matchup, because I used to main Raiden. So uh, I haven't played too many Barakas, with the exception of Alex. But I'm not sure if you are aware, if you play against Alex, you don't get the opportunity to play too much, because Alex presses all the right buttons. So... (laughs) <laughs> we'll, see, we'll see how this happens, how this plays out. Absolutely. Ooh, with a Sector cameo, actually, which is going to be kind of interesting. I do love this ketchup and mustard that we're seeing with Crispy Gujon utilizing Cyrax. Oh, actually, yeah, I just noticed that, too. Still using the Cyrax. Baraka Cyrax, even after the nerf? I love that, actually. I mean, you know... Some people are very reactive. Mm-hmm. They think any change and it's ruined, but let's be serious. Cyrax is such a Swiss Army knife of utility. Yes, yeah, so true. He Even does. if you can't use him as often and he doesn't do quite as much damage, his utility is still damn near unmatched. Um, They, they changed that. The, the throw is now, like, what, two bars now, I think, huh? I think the throw cancel was always two bars of meter, but I don't know if it's two bars of summon. Because that right. is a big Ooh. part of Cyrax, of Baraka's game plan with Cyrax. Mm-hmm. Those throw combos off of the normal helicopter summon. Okay, I do like Todara's use of the uh, the Electro Ball uh, right at the end right there. The two low sweeps into the Electro Ball just got the hit. Took the first round. Ooh, wow. Making projectiles safe with more projectiles. Here we go. It's One, two, buff my shoes. Nice overhead, overhead from yeah. Gujon. I thought he messed up the execution, but it was no. You got a neutral deck, though. That's going to be critical if Todaro can figure out what. I have never seen a use for that move ever. Wow. That's right, crazy. A little bit of an execution drop there, but the amazing thing I'd like to see is what happens when it does not hit. Because I love to use that move normally with both Jax and Cyrax. Because you can make it safe with those cameos. He uh, he won the first round in Fatality, and we are in for the long game. You know, I think if I were to ask Tadaro now, his opinion is give the people what they want. Yeah, absolutely. Get some blood, get some guts. Uh, I told Mr. Extraordinary to do the, uh, the Fatality against me on the last one. He said, I don't know it. <laughs> That's a thing you'll find <laughs> with a lot of people that lab the game hella hardcore. Don't know the Fatalities. Don't know the Fatalities, but they know like 30 hit combos. <laughs> It's crazy to me. It's four inputs. They know, like, YouTube highlights that you'll never see in a real competitive match because they're too hard to do. Right. But uh, two button directions and two normal face buttons? No, I just need that for Nice throw punish, but he could have gotten a lot more. Never mind. Maybe it was a strategic thing to swap sides into the corner. Gujon keeping it safe with the stagger pressure off of that kick move. Wow! That is the first normal I have ever seen. Well, that was a special, but I cannot dodge that missile to save my life, even if I'm hitting my opponent. I have teleported and it still just tracks me across the screen. The fact that it's an ambush is absurdly good. Yes. 
Here we go. Nope. Deuce will tuck those. Good. We got a close match right now. Are we gonna see? Nice. Keeping it safe. Good blocks from Tadaro. Mm -hmm. Gujan just mm -hmm. really throwing everything yeah. at him. If he had committed to that string, I, he would have hit him with the last. Tadaro yeah. said, no thank you. Oh, did not hit confirm. Goes for the overhead pressure. Yes, you see how it pushes you away? That's the best part of the EX version. It is practically safe. Oh, and Gujon just hits him with the tippity tip of the grippers. sneaky overhead. Wow. You never see it coming. He just, like a Blanca. Oh! Okay, that teleport's so bad, but Tadaro making it work. EX Thunder Wave. Oh, the raw teleport. Oh, no conversion, though. Gets punished for it. Okay. Okay. Oh, no. Tadaro with the execution. The timing on that does look very tight because, Ooh, going you know, through it. I haven't hand. seen that combo either off of the EX Thunder Wave. No neutral duck yet from Tadaro. We're safe. Oh, never mind. All right, Crispy Gujan will have a response here because that is going to be game two. Good blocks from Tadaro. Didn't mean to do the standing three, but it worked out for him anyway. Up missile pressure, nice special move from Gujon to close the gap. Saying, yeah, I know you're summoning missiles, but I am just that fast of a move. Down three. Okay, okay. We're seeing 30% in utility with the sector cameo using up missile. And he does have the chip damage buff with that move. The first knee of the set from Gujon, but it's not enough. Oh, Will he see chip oh, out? Okay, yes. Very good composure from Tadaro. Flawless block. He said, I'm not taking chip damage from this. A lot of back and forth with the grippers between Raiden and Baraka. Wake up from Tadaro gets knocked out of the teleport startup. Big hit. Are they getting loud for this? Or is no, they're okay, getting Street loud Fighter for over Street there? Fighter. Gotcha. Street Fighter Tings. They just popped off at the right time. <laughs> it lined up very well. So safe with that Thunder Wave. The reversal not fast enough. I wonder if Tadaro was taking notes. I know I was. Bing, bing, forward, three, four. That's so crazy. Into the utility, but that move reaches oh, too yeah. far. Sure does. That is a solid answer to that setup. seen a flawless block attempt from Gujan yet against all that chip damage. Okay, the follow-up. Didn't nope, realize the overhead that time. Come back with an overhead of his own. The pressure from up missile is so strong. A That's a low cool combo yeah, punish! It's, it, you're, it's crazy how safe that is. It's one of the uh, annoying things about fighting Raiden. <laughs> Thankfully, there are some gaps in the armor. This teleport is not the best. It could be a little bit better. I know I'm biased. Okay. Okay. Game four, no players select yet, no breathers. I'm gonna go grab a drink. Please do. I'll, yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, let's see.
Do 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 do. Oh no, unfortunately, that Cyrax timing a little iffy. I'm sure Gujon did not want Raiden out of the corner, but it might be okay. There's the summon. It does only take one bar. Good momentum. Crispy having a, a nice time. No neutral duck from Tadara. Still a little bit too afraid. You really want to duck that to get a, at least a conditioning tool. Put it in their mind. Twinkle Toes from Tataro to start round two. Goes for the unsafe projectile. Pujan not ready for the punish. Uh-oh, flawless block, let's go. It's your turn. Oh, swing, 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 swing. Good overhead from Tataro setting up. Nice missile, that should be a juicy little bit of damage. Into the standing three lightning hands, standing three lightning hands. Missiles, missiles, oh my goodness, the momentum has turned around. What'd I miss? The, just a lot of sector up missiles providing great utility for Tadaro. Raiden on the wrong side of the screen, but luckily that summit, oh, 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 oh. and just like that, Since it's anybody's into the match. corner. Oh, gets a combo. Okay, Big damage. Wow. he believes Big it. Big damage. He believes it. I don't know if I agree with this fatal blow, but let's see what happens. And the follow-up from Tadaro. And now it, it does make it even, and he gets the bleed too, so. Yes. Oh no! Oh, that's it! Wow. Wowie, wowie, wow. You don't see that net very often. It's funny because I was thinking earlier whenever they were using an asset, I, I personally don't understand the utility of it because it never seems to connect. Lo and behold, it Sometimes does once every blue moon. If only to remind your opponent that it exists. Oh, wow, the up missile doing such a good job keeping the approach safe on that low, which Notably, a lot of Raiden players get a little uh, about because it's like, oh, will they high profile me? Are they going to just try to hitbox me? But Sector's up missile, the tracking, very good in this game. The sword staying broken off in Raiden's shoulder was making me laugh inside. Uh, 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 uh. Crispy Kujan with a very strong round. Here. Didn't even get below 75. Almost a repeat of what happened last set. <laughs> indeed, indeed. Twinkle Toes, that should have been his turn. He was afraid of, I don't know what, because he's not using Sector's ambush. He's not using the up missile sort of a, a keep my pressure tool in that situation. Wow, the first use of the flame, but I don't think Tagaro meant to do that. Still gets a nice combo out of it there. It's gonna be around 30% into up missile. Still not getting caught. Maybe play some Hearthstone. I lost my penny. I'm sorry. I don't know where it is. If I it's see a bigger deal than what I see. Uh, has, has, has anyone seen Rick's pen? Chat, have you seen Rick's pen? If y'all have seen Rick's pen, please return it to Rick. He is going crazy. But, th but shout outs to Rick at the same time. He's doing yeah. a great job running Putting this it thing. together. The plan, the action, the execution, the marketing. Once again, people, watch the video. It's pretty fun. We... I think we restored the timeline. <laughs> I think we restored the timeline with we, this event tonight. We, the grudge. Pruned, we've pruned the, the weeds that were the, the runoff, the extra the, strands. The grudge paradox is officially canon. Y'all heard it here first. We wrapped our cables, uh, which was totally an unintentional metaphor that we just came up with on the day of shooting, which really did work out pretty well visually. <laughs> A lot of that was by the seat of the pants, and I wouldn't have had it anymore. That whole video was so funny. Nice arbor break from Gujon. First one of the set. Very confident playing right now. Are we going to see a throw attempt or are we going to see the overhead? Nice blocks from Tadaro. Not taking his turn back yet. Good overhead, but can he keep up the momentum into the double hitting low? Look at how safe that is. Gujon has almost no choice but to respect it. Nice overhead. He's gonna have to rush in if he wants to do something and that's gonna be game five. 
Going up 4-1. Goodbye to Dara to go back to character select. I support this. Confirming or not having the execution to follow up on that hit. The gripper is catching Jadara, and this is going to be a rough setup. It will be next hit kills. No flawless block, and that was going to be chip out regardless. Very strong round from Crispy Guzzo. My goodness, we're seeing Serena. I didn't even notice. I was checking my spam email folder. The Twinkle Toes, good neutral punish from Crispy. Mm -mm. Swing, 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 swing. Cyrax's biggest, worstest matchup, always execution. And the Cyrax summon to follow it up into, oh, drop. Slapping him in the toes, but Gujon is not biting. Tadaro having a rough time opening him up. Goes for the teleport. Single low. It's like I'm seeing single low, double low, single low, double low. Let's cop some wackiness. Let's do the triple low, the forbidden jutsu. Who won that one? Who won that one? Gujon won that one. Gujon, gotcha. Sorry, I was on my phone. That's I'm okay. back. That's okay. Ladies, gentlemen's plus. Trying to let my ride know. I'm going to be a little later than I thought tonight. And you know, it's good to keep people informed. I had to give my mom a ride today. She had a flat tire. It was at her office. Took her back. Got her car fixed. Whole ordeal. Flat tires are never fun. She texted me at least seven times to see if I was on the way. Because I woke <laughs> up a little late. Oops. Love you, Mom. Mother. <sighs> that is killing Tadaro. We're not going to coach, but man, you got to neutral duck that just to condition. Oh, I can guarantee. I, for what it's worth, whenever I was playing, I, you were being pretty loud. And I couldn't hear a damn. So well, I mean, the room itself. I have ear. Head, I wear earbuds that mm -hmm. dampen audio. Yeah, no, it is loud out there. We couldn't hear anything. It is that disorienting. Was here. It is very disorienting. It's like literally the seal right here by this door. It's a. It's like it's a wall. There's a wall right here a, that you can't portal. see. It's a secret portal. It's a secret portal. Oh, okay. The standing one, I think that's like the first standing one of the set from Tajaro. Crispy Gujan, just like a machine, just very consistent in his play style. Oh, oh but Serena! Serena! Let's go. Here we go. When did we switch? Paying dividends two matches ago. This is the first <laughs> time you've really seen it with a nice clean hit. And I think that's what Tadaro's looking for. He wants to create a little bit of more chaos in the neutral. I mean, when you're down four games, it is time to make a switch. Box the overhead. Nice work from Tadaro. Oh, does he hit it? No, that timing must be so strict. And it's going to be game seven to Crispy. I know, man. I know. It is. It's hard. And it's hard when you feel that momentum. What was it like in your set when the momentum started going towards extraordinary? Um, rough. Very, very rough. Like, it... it, it and it really sucks too because you're watching yourself make poor decisions because you're tilted, you know. But there's almost it's it's almost like there's nothing you can do about it sometimes just because of how you're feeling. It's just like I, you're almost me specifically. Yeah. I get hard headed. I just wanted to hit him with that frost assist so many times, Absolutely. and I got punished for it so much. It's a Tod Tod Tadaro, maybe a little more level headed than I am. 
you know, but he's still very stubborn with his like neutral style because Crispy seems to be reacting very well to the single low, double low style. Uh, I'm not seeing like walkbacks, you know, it's... I'm also seeing him use that a lot more too, you know, not really trying to... Uh, I feel like he can probably get... You know, again, Tadar is a higher ranked player than I am, so obviously there's something I feel like that they're, he's seeing that I'm not. And it's the amount these two play each other, and they play each other all the time. Oh, okay, so there's mind games at play that we're not even there's seeing. There's meta levels fours and fives going on. Gotcha, okay. Now, I like this one, I like this one too. I like this overhead. Steal the meter. That's what I want to see. Wow, look at that. A that? whole bar just gone. Huh. Yeah, Serena is... That's a move not enough people utilize, but it is so powerful in certain situations. You need the neutral duck that. It is, I am gonna roll up at the set. Meter. It drains meter, yeah. That's the, that, that is the point of that assist. Hmm. And it's her only ambush. Swing, let's go. Finally connecting, nice work to Daro. And then doing that with the, uh, with the low enhance. Exactly, it's you're basically really good. guaranteed you... to lose a bar. They're losing bar and then you're chipping them too at the same time. Unless they flawless block. I mean, true, very true. And we're And we're going to be seeing that more as the game develops. Oh, the yes. The flawless block's getting more in touch, just like MK11. And what I really want to see more of is up blocks. They're few and up far blocks. between, but you're going to... I love up blocks. After year one, this game is going to be insanely neutral jump that's empty because they're baiting up blocks. I, because up block locks you in. There's that frame of recovery. Yeah, I love up block so much. Speak of the double. It's so funny. It's just because, like, I play a lot of online like, combat league, and it's Absolutely. just like you would be surprised of how many people online don't just aren't aware of up block's existence. For the most part, they haven't been. Their full potential has not been realized. Mm hmm. And also, I think there is some hangover from the previous game because, you know, flawless blocks. Ooh, that's are... gonna be wow. big damage right okay, here. here. We go. 35. One, two, oh, the foot. Ke kept it to just one bar. Kept it for one bar. Fair. He's gonna wanna. He's uh, he's not gonna have break. Oh, where's the mix? Oh, okay. oh but that that could oh. be it. No, no. Serena. No Serena summon. No Serena summon. Oh, I know Tadaro's feeling bad about that one. Man, did we panic? I think so. Some, and that happens too. Dude, That's another thing. Whenever you're in these sticky situations, so real. you just and, and it's the worst too. And kind of circling back around to what I said earlier, you know, you just watch yourself make these mistakes that you just can't fix. Like right there, didn't that, hit confirm the second low into lightning hands. You know, to where it's not even just bad decision making; it's poor execution too. You know. And that's uh, the worst. You feel your mind knows what to do, but your hands won't do mm -hmm, that. Mm -hmm. And then you just spaghetti all over your controller. And uh, I have a habit where if I don't land the move I want to do, like the wrong you, thing comes you do out, it again. I will span that move yep, until it do, comes out just do to it prove again. to my mind, like, no, I know the input. <laughs> no, I can do the move. Okay, here we go. Crossover. Jump kick from Crispy. Yeah, Tadaro in the corner now. Not Jumping where he wants to be. Yeah, teleport out Down of there. Teleport check. out of there. Nice. Okay, okay. the follow-up. No. Okay, try follow -up. to go for probably standing four lightning hands because the forward three has not been working. All right. Okay. Anybody's maybe, round. Maybe chip him out a little bit. Ooh, the one Serena? Okay, I like that. I like that. Yeah, just getting it back. Okay, charge it a little. Yeah, okay, we're on the same page here, Raiden. Oh, that could have been it. <gasps> nice throw from Crispy. Really composed. Next hit wins. Mm. No, oh, don't talk oh. that killed him. That's, nice. Yeah, that's oh. chipping. It's chipping. Boop, 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 boop. Skibbity, boop, boop. Yes, yes. Good character select. Take a breath. Oh, that wasn't character oh, select. I, thought, I actually thought I saw a character select too for some reason. Down four from Crispy to start the match off. We're trading feats. We're trading feet picks. Swing the net. Love it. Oh, try to get the flawless block, but that's gonna hurt. Take the teleport, get out of there. Return center stage. Return center stage, I like that. It's safe. Oh. Oh. oh okay, no. We got lucky, no confirm off of that. Crispy Goujon. 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 Okay. Yeah, it's probably Goujon. Crispy. But, you know, we'll call him Crispy. <laughs> 
He's uh, battered in a little cornstarch right now, and he's doing some work in this kitchen. The overhead. Frying up a Raiden. Into the Cyrax summon. Doesn't do as much damage, but still 20% off of the throw is insane. Oh. Good block from Tadaro. Come on. No flawless block. Tried to get it. Oh, that could have been a standing one. Down. Uh, okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, okay. we got some damage in here. Interesting going for the low sweep, though. Oh, probably to do that. Yeah, okay. Wow! That is yeah. a silly combo. Okay, because I was curious on why he didn't go for the 2 4 2 1. But that would make sense because you can't connect the, du the double cartwheel exactly. at the end. That was a really nice combo from Tadaro. Nice overhead. Just barely hit him out of his string. Throws from Crispy. And no summon! Rare, rare change-up? And then he did the yeah, move. sweeping, slightly low tilted? profiling underneath the input. I don't know what it's called, but Baraka scissors. Chop chop? Chop chop. I bet, I bet it actually is called chop chop. I think it is. I'm not the best with the names. I know what they look like. Swing. Okay, nice damage from Crispy. Oh, that was the wrong input from Crispy. But Tadaro doesn't capitalize. Nice, the follow-up. Oh, he's trying to do standing four. He doesn't trust his execution on forward three, but that's dropped twice now as well. Ooh, okay. He wants to get in. That could have been a follow-up from Crispy, but I know that timing is rough as a fellow Cyrax enjoyer. And it's going on to game 10. Crispy Gujon with a commanding, undeniable line one. And Tadaro starting oh, yeah, off. Yeah, going strong. in heavy, double cartwheel. The one, two, zippy zap. Ending into the corner. Oh, oh, didn't get the two, a little, conversion a little off. Of it. Oh, but okay. this could be. Okay, it wasn't. Didn't, it was not EX. Yeah, it didn't send it off. It was EX, but it has an extra input for you to send it off. Oh, I didn't. Know. Okay, so yeah, so that's actually the EX version of the ball of lightning that surrounds Raiden. Yes. Yes. Uh, and then there's another input at the end to do the. Correct. You have to press uh, uh, enhance again in order to send oh, it off. Nice. I love this. I learned something new today. Overhead from Crispy. His momentum is going to get started, but Cyrax's biggest problem always execution ever since K9. Swing. See the back two right there from Raiden. First one in a while. Here we go. Oh, nice. there we go. You see, yeah, mix it in there a little bit. Oh, and a, a bold wake up EX. Oh, I nice love it. Done enhance, to secure the round. Enhance Superman. What's the point of Over, either if you're dead? all reliable? Uh, some would say. Look at my mother. It's coming. Another projectile. Oh no, the trade from the net. Wow, we. It took a minute, but Gujan landed that net. Oh, nice high profile over it with that overhead. The Yoshimitsu move, I think I like to call it. Because he hops on the blade, yeah, yeah. right? I, I'm, not, I'm not the most first in second, Oops. but... Yeah, 2-4-2-1, two, two, we go in Serena. Here we go. Yeah, cartwheel. 2-1. No, another cartwheel. Another cartwheel. Wow, oh, standing the... four. Standing four again. Love that. that. Nice corner. Love combo. that. Stealing it. Write that down. Write that down. Yeah, clip, twitch, chat. Can you clip that? <laughs> All right, Gujan not deterred. Okay, Although took... playing a little patient. Wow, he got... He's very happy about that hit. Tadara not giving up just yet, but we're not going to break at the end of the combo. Save the meter. Oh, I oh, think that I was his turn. Back in. He's going to wake up EX. No! No wake up EX. Oh, good. Good break. blocks. I, I predict a fatal blow. Good break. Never mind. Good, break. good breaker. This could result in a timeout. I'm actually calling a timeout. Oh, no. Tadaro has to go in. <gasps> He's got Serena, but can he make it happen? Oh, my goodness! Round three. Crispy on match point. My heart rate Crisp, is actually crispy accelerating. On, crispy on set point. Nice! Oh, no. Didn't follow believe. up. Ay, ay, ay. That timing must be abysmal. Because he has connected that maybe once out of every ten times. 
crispy, just very consistent. I think if Todaro had landed a lot of those converts, we would be seeing a different score. Oh, absolutely. For sure. Here we go. But, you know, as is tournament jitters, you know. Oh, my goodness. And I, I heard Rick say this the other day, actually. There are good players, and then there are good tournament players. And they sometimes they aren't the same. Absolutely. Like, sometimes the Venn diagram will be very small with those two circles. It's a different skill set. It is, it is a different frame of mind, and it is a different type of pressure you feel. Mm -hmm. If you don't compete, it's hard to really explain. And then, like, y'all have to realize, I'm not sure if y'all see the setup, but, like, they're on the big screen. They have a crowd around them. Yeah, like, there's, the, a, there's, the spotlights eight foot, there's an eight-foot, like, giant wall behind the them. The spotlights are on them. Like, they, they are in the mix of it right now. And it looks like next hit might take it for Crispy, mm -hmm. and the trade will be Crispy Goujon 10 to 1. Congrats to both players. Thank you guys for showing up and thank you for putting your money up. Yes. This is Kilgore Trout. I'm Curls. And it is such a pleasure to be here tonight at Little Wars. Shout outs to Little Wars. Shout outs to Little Wars. Uh, wait, hold on. Yeah, it's going to pop up down there at some point eventually. Uh, so who do we have next? I, I, I was told three Mortal Kombat money matches. I'm I'm looking forward to the next one. I was one. They just did another one. Yeah, so you know, there's, there's got to be a third one. Yeah, we gotta have, we gotta have a third one. We can't only have two Mortal Kombat money matches happening at the front. Right? No, that's absolutely right, Curls. Also, we've got some stream denizens saying they want to come to. Frame Trap Fridays. Frame, frame Frame Trap Friday? Frame Data Friday? Frame Data Fridays. Frame Frame Trap Friday, that's funny. Although stealing it, probably please, use please it. Yeah, steal. it is, it's coin. It, it is. If April Fool's falls it is on Creative Friday. Commons. Fair use. Let's see. It's always so fun when you get off the tournament set up. The Pina Gallery. The jeers, the cheers. Uh, all your boys coming up to you and everything. The, the like, you know, things. good stuff and everything, you know, dapping you up. You know, even if, whether you win or you lose, everyone's everyone's having a good Unsolicited time. advice. Rick, Rick. Uh, I gotta go. That's all I gotta say. That's all we save the time. What? This is the canon event. It's, this is the canon event. It the is. the Nexus event. The paradox. Is emerging. We've been pruning timelines left and right back here. In different multiverses, I'm some kind of stupid idiot. Over here, I'm just a regular shit. What's going on, stream? It's nice to, to put this back on. <laughs> Rick showing up on the ring camera like, hey. Three matches remain, all Street Fighter. Three? Oh, wait. Street Fighter. Okay. 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 Hey, cool. plans change. We're flexible. We're liquid. It's all good. You're sponsored by liquid? I'm jealous. <laughs> Jealous? Wait, yes. we're Liquid? <laughs> I'm sponsored by Liquid? I'm sponsored by GOL. By association, I would say so, yeah. I would say so as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Yo. I brought a charger. A charger? You got a type C? I'm that cable. It's going to have to stay in here. Oh, my shit is super, it's like dead. I, I don't have any it's, battery. Wait, it's like dead or? No, it, it is dead. It is oh, it is dead. dead. Okay. Look, watch, it's going to pop up. Zero percent. And as I know, next to nothing Zero percent. Wow, he wasn't fans, lying. I will be hopping off the commentator box, but it was an absolute yeah. pleasure. Absolutely. You as well. Nice I to see you again. Nice to see you again, and we'll play some casuals. <laughs> yeah, let's do it. Frame track. Frame data Friday. Frame data Friday is entirely online. You, you play on PS5? No. But I could get on my roommate's PS5. Okay, okay bet, bet. We will stay in touch. I'm in the Discord. Good. I'm Absolutely. in the Discord as well. Thanks, guys. I'll see you next time.